Hello kids, today we will learn about Unit 10, Volume and Capacity. We will learn how to compare and order volumes and capacities. First of all, okay, let's have a short vocabulary check and pronunciation. Please repeat after me. Number one, volume. Volume. Number two, capacity. Capacity. Number three, leader. Leader. Number four, milliliter. Milliliter. Number five, tablespoon. Tablespoon. Number six, teaspoon. Teaspoon. Number seven, cup, cup. Number eight, greater than, greater than. Number nine, less than, less than. Number ten, smaller than, smaller than. Now you try. Number one, volume. Number two, capacity. Number three, leader. Number four, milliliter. Number five, tablespoon. Number six, teaspoon. Number seven, cup. Number eight, greater than. Number nine, less than. Number ten, smaller than. Very good. Now let's see and learn on how to compare volumes using greater than, smaller than, and equal to. These containers contain different volumes of water. Pail A has 3 liters, 500 milliliters of water. Pail B has 5 liters of water. So, Pail B has blank volume of water than Pail A. Is it greater? Smaller or equal to? Very good. It's greater. Pail B has greater volume of water than Pail A because Pail B has more volume of water. Look at these containers. Jar A, when full, contains 8 tablespoons or 120 milliliters. Remember, 1 tablespoon is equal to 15 milliliter as estimated. So, 8 multiplied by 15 is equal to 120. Now, jar B, when full, contains 8 tablespoons or 120 milliliters. Now, jar A has blank capacity with jar B. Is it greater, smaller, or equal to? Good job! It is equal because they have the same capacity. Now, how do we order volumes and capacity? from greatest to smallest or smallest to greatest. First, we need to find which has the greatest and the smallest volume. Okay, look at these different volumes. Which is the smallest volume? Which is the greatest volume? Okay, so first step. We need to convert different units of volumes and then compare the volumes. 
Okay, so we need to convert them into milliliter. Now, remember, one liter is equals to 1,000 milliliter. One teaspoon is equals to five milliliters. One tablespoon is equals to 15 milliliters. And one cup is equals to 240 milliliters as estimated. Now, 1850 milliliters so it stays the same next one liter 630 milliliters is how many milliliters so first one liter is 1000 milliliter plus 630 milliliters equals to 1630 milliliters next four cups now again, one cup is 240 milliliters. Now we have four cups. So four cups, four times 240 milliliters is equals to 960 milliliters. Next, 38 tablespoons. Now we need to change into milliliters. Now one tablespoon is equals to 15 milliliters. So 38 multiplied by 15 milliliters is equals to 570 milliliters now one teaspoon is equals to 5 milliliters now 42 times 5 milliliters is equals to 210 milliliters next now let's order these volumes into smallest to greatest so the greatest volume is 1850 milliliters and the smallest volume is 42 teaspoons because 42 teaspoons is equal to 210 milliliters now first is 42 teaspoon as the smallest next is very good 38 tablespoons next is four cups because four cups has 960 milliliters next is one liter 630 milliliters and the last one is 1850 milliliters as the greatest okay so that's all for today thank you for listening goodbye